Hey folks, Matt here, and in this video we're going to talk about Support Bennett. First of all, let me show you what can he offer as a support. For me, he is good with pretty much every team comp you can think about. He heals, he gives you bonus attack, and he's pyro element. Here is Bennett versus the Volin's Breath to show you how strong is his healing. And here is bonus attack for anyone who stands in his ult. I created another universe and founded paradise for I. <laughs> Playing him does not require a huge skill, whether he's just press and win character, at least for support. If you are interested on playing him as a DPS, big shout out to Hyodachi with his insane build. Let's move on. First, let's talk about his stat priorities. There are three crucial stats that you need to prioritize. Base attack, energy recharge, and max HP. Base attack effects on how much attack bonus can he give with his ult also depends on his talent level. Where can you find them? As for now, there's only two main sources of base attack. Those are character base attack and weapons base attack. Moving on to ER. This is also important because it can help you maintain his ultimate. I feel like running 250 to 300% ER is perfect when there's only one pyro on your team. And running 200% ish is great when there are two or more. Notice there is only 3 seconds downtime or cooldown on his ult. Where can you get them? Leveling up Bennett will increase his energy recharge, sense of Eon, weapons, and artifacts, and specific artifact sets like Schooler or Exile. Last but not least, it's going to be max HP. This affects your healing as well as your sustainability with him. When you are healing with his ult, keep in mind that it is healing over time. So where can you find HP? For now, you can get them from character level and artifacts. Also, healing bonus further amplify his healing. He can heal up to 10k per tick. But I don't think it is necessary, at least for now. Having Bennett on your team is nice because he can tolerate clumsiness. Like if you miss a dodge or you need some extra damage, Bennett's got your back. I even use him occasionally for Spiral Abyss and testing damage. That is pretty much it for my Bennett build and I will be updating it soon when I get good artifact for him. Thank you for watching and if you do enjoy the video, please leave a like, comment and subscribe to support me. Med signing out. Have a good one.